Hello everyone. Welcome back to Hands on Study Hub. Today's video is very important for all Windows 11 users. So, as we all know, Microsoft recently rolled out the Windows 11, which is 24H2 Security Update KB50 63878 series. And unfortunately, it's causing major problems and issues for many users worldwide. So, this update is linked to SSD and hard disk failures, data corruption, and even complete drive inaccessibility. So, some users reported their systems crashing uh, and otherwise uh, their files becoming corrupted and in some worst cases, people could not even boot back up into uh, Windows or any other files, which is very important. So, if you recently updated your Windows 11, you need to check if this problematic update is installed on your system. So, let me show you step by step how to how to uninstall uh, this update safely. So, for this, kindly follow the steps very carefully. So, uh, press Windows plus R on your keyboard. So, and then type app with app wichair.cpl command and then press enter okay now a window will open called programs and features and on the left side click view install updates so here you will see a list of updates installed on your PC. Look for KP50 63878. So, one, oh, once you find it, click on it and select uninstall and then restart your computer to complete the process. So, why this is so important? So, uninstalling this update can help you avoid drive crashes, boot errors and file corruption and even permanent data loss. So, until Microsoft releases a stable fix, we need to stay safe and not risk our data and our storage devices. So, right? So, and my final advice is that always keep your backup of your important files and if you notice strange behavior after updates, so don't ignore it. Sometimes even official updates can cause unexpected issues just like this so that's it for today's video i hope this guide help you protect your system if you found this useful please give a like share subscribe and share it with your friends to keep them safe and don't forget to subscribe hands on study hub thank you